What's up, everybody? Pack Bros are back. I'm Rob. I'm Chris. And today we're breaking not one, but two boxes of 23-24 artifacts. Of course, we're looking for the Bedard cards out of here. Uh, it is assumed that he is the Chicago Blackhawks Redemption, as well as the Roman numeral or numeration number ones. That is dangerous to just shiver through like that. No, that's fine. Jesus. It's all good. Can I, can I have it, please? There are also some Team Canada Bedard variations in here. Um, so, I guess, unofficial rookies, so to say. Uh, we did two boxes because we told you guys we were going to Bedard chase, and here we are. We're not big-time rollers where we're breaking cases of this stuff. That's just not who we are. Uh, as I've said before on this channel, we're two average guys who, you know, are just genuine collectors and breakers. Uh, we don't get loaded boxes. We don't have our own store. We just go to local hobby stores around our area and purchase product as we can. Um, so what you see here is a real example of what you could be purchasing from any of these local hobby stores. Mm -hmm. I will say they've done a very good job of kind of creating dispersion. I don't see any discernibly thick packs, so we should be getting some decoys out of this. I don't know if it's a bad sign, but we did just have a massive hit out of an old artifacts product. So if you haven't seen that video of the 2122, yes. Yeah. Uh, artifacts box that we did go take a look at that wicked hit that we pulled from there but without further ado let's get some bedard do you want to go first for me uh you can go for this one okay so i do believe they cite on the box it is collectively two hits per box uh, i don't know what they qualify as a hit uh, i know that pretty much every box has something in it could just be a numbered card um i will say this off the jump i like the design cleaner design or you know a little bit more of a I don't know, a little different than I've seen the past couple of years, in, in a good way. So, uh, Josh Morrissey base, and right away we're getting a clear-cut rookie, which I know is a short okay. print. Lucas Rusek, that might be one of my hits. Don't know if the kid's any good. Well, he got two points in two games for the Sabres in, in his first season, so that's not All bad. Right. Uh, and clear is uh, definitely a short print. So, there's my first hit. Kevin Hayes, Jake Sanderson on the back. I hope that doesn't count as your first hit. I hope not too, but I just I don't know what they consider hits. I know the rookies themselves are not hits, mm -hmm. but would the clear-cut version be a hit? I don't know. Drake Batherson, Kale McCarr, Johnny Gaudreau, Artifacts, Orem. That is a redemption or a bounty card, I mean. Not redemption. I do like that Orem design better than uh, 2021. They went a bit thinner, too. Yeah. All right, we have Nikolai Ehlers. Gabe Velarde, dual jersey, number to 249. Gabe Velarde's playing very well for the Kings right now. His stock is way up. Good. And you know what's funny? I, I mean, I know I know the gray is just gray, the two jersey cards, but I kind of like the gray. It looks nice. It does look good. You know? It, I, I know that's their equivalent of white, but, like, you know, it, it's it's nice. It's better than your standard white, yeah. which you get on, like, almost every other team jersey. <laughs> yes, the tablecloth. You know I'm setting it is to get... A dual double, patch is both white. Double white. Lekkonen, Sod, Charlie Coyle, Autofax. <laughs> oh, man, what a box. <laughs> Here's the thing. I don't think we've ever pulled an Autofax before. I don't think so. Historically, Autofax and Artifacts is just a way for them to dump their old stickers. Oh, okay. If you look at the Autofax list, you will die laughing at the randomness of the checklist. Because it's literally just a bunch of random players. Most, More often than not, they're like, they've been traded or they've been around the block. Right. And they're just looking to get rid of their sticker autos. That's always how it's been for years. The auto fax is always like, there's a group A that's nice, but like group like D, C, B, bunch of randoms. Markstrom and a Sidney Ooh, Crosby. Okay. Number to 599. Not bad. There's a little bit of irony in this. You'll have to watch our last video to understand why. <laughs> Base, base. Crosby's following us in artifacts recently. I'm not upset by it. Three packs left. I will be honest. This pack has been, or this box has been less than um, ideal. I will say there's usually one redemption, or historically there's been one redemption. Jacob Peltier, numbered to 299. Not bad. Uh, historically, there's always one redemption per, per box. Uh -huh. But we'll see. Is it a redemption redemption or a rookie redemption? Well, the redemptions are rookie redemptions. They only do worker redemptions and artifacts. Oh, okay. I like that then. I like that. That, that gives us decent odds. Yeah. It's it's their way of putting the rookies in the product without the rookies having been started yet. Right. Because this product was being made before the season started. Yeah. Heischer, Stamkos, Nugent Hopkins to four ninety nine. 
And here's hoping that uh, this last pack has a redemption card in it. Looking for Black Fox or looking for Roman numeral one or something of that sort. Uh, I'll pull off the back. Cider, Forsberg, Besser, and a Pat Lafontaine to 65. I guess Strange. it's called like a sunset uh, based on this. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Pat Lafon Lafontaine is a, is a legend. Interesting. Obviously, I'm going to guess it's a sunset to 65. You can start, Chris. My box here is not so good. Not very nice. Hopefully, mine is a lot better. Starting it off with Dylan Gunther, Charlie Coyle, our new best friend. Ooh, Ooh. Devin Levi, rookie out of 299. Very nice, very nice. Okay, okay. Powerful decoy, Brady Kachuk behind. That's a good start. I like it, I like it. Yeah, that's a good start. Stop my video. Kale McCarr. Ooh. Okay. Doubling up here with Akito Heroes. Hirose. Hirose out of 4.99. Another strong decoy. Jeff Skinner, Nugent Hopkins behind. First two packs, two numbered cards. I like it. Logan Couture. Oh, geez. what is happening, dude? Jesus. Aiden, Mc... <laughs> Aiden McDonough. Yeah, sure. Dual jersey, green and blue, out of five ninety nine. What is going on? They got a hot box. I, I hope so. It'll like even out for your. Uh, or hope, for hopefully, your not, you haven't gone too hot too soon. That's that's the other concern. Then now you're just gonna get a bunch of crap. Well, that was another, a new jersey. Another, another thick card here. Dylan Strom. Ooh, ooh, what is ooh. happening in this box? What's the number two? Where is Chelios? I didn't even see the number 45. 45, very 45 nice. dual jersey auto. Very nice. What is going on, dude? Thank God you recovered for us. Wow. All my hits were in your box. Apparently. You stole them. That's a nice hit. I, did, I, I got an auto fax. You got an auto fax. I got Charlie Coyle. In my first four packs, I've gotten a dual jersey auto out of 45, a dual jersey out of 599, a rookie out of 499, and a rookie out of 299. And you Sorry, got, that was a rookie dual jersey out of 599. And, and, and Devin Levi was your best rookie numeration. Holy too. smokes. Well, I ain't got a Crosby out of 599. That's another hit. Seriously? This is actually a hot box? Is that a thing? No, I think they just missed back it. But we're not complaining. Oh, okay, it's an orum. It's an orum. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Is it numbered? No. No. It looked different, no? No. No, it's the same. It's just design. It's because the rookie symbol there. Jesus. It's going to be like a hit per pack. I mean, it is. Mine were just all ass. All right. Th this might be the first normal one. A redemption would be nice. Mika Zibanejad. Michael Bunting out of 299. I, this box is weird. It's set. Oh, Slavkovsky. That's your worst hit, and it's a two ninety nine. It's satisfyingly weird. I want a redemption, please. That would that would top this box off. That would be amazing. Patrice Bergeron, Jared McCann, Kevin Fiala, Jesus. fifty out of fifty. That's an eBay one hundred and one. Dude, this box is the nutty. thing. The the nice part is even on your like crappy numbered cards, air quote, they're nicely numbered. Yeah. All right, last pack. Redemption, redemption, redemption. It is not a jersey. Could be a redemption. Could be an auto. Joel Erickson. You're going to pull from the back on this one. Neil Pionk. Yep. Zach Warensky. Yep. Decoys behind. So here we go with the last hit. Wild card. Oh. Rookie redemption wild card. Yeah, it's, it's not It's not a card. Well... That box was insane. Unless they plot twist the hell out of it and they make the Chicago Redemption somebody else and Bedard's a wild card. I'd, That'd be hilarious. I wouldn't put it past them. Can I see it? The wild, the wild card? 249. So That's I think, insane. I think the second last one, I think. So, in this one box, Kevin Fiala, 50 out of 50. Michael Bunting out of 299. Rookie Devin Levi artifacts are a dual jersey auto out of 45 of Chris Chelios. A rookie, dual jersey out of five ninety nine of Aiden McDonough. A rookie of Akito Heros Hirose. Sure, why not? Out of four ninety nine and a Devin Levi rookie out of two ninety nine. 
That was insane. Well, I got a Charlie Coyle autograph. <laughs> Thumbnail. And a rookie redemption wild card. That's nuts. Wow. Yeah. Holy smokes. Our artifacts luck just like transferred through. Maybe yeah. not on that box, yeah. but yeah. like transferred past me through you. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. How many hits is that total? You're supposed to get like one hit per pack. Three. There's no four, base packs in our five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Eight. You just happened to hit on every single one. Wow. I got eight too. It's just some of them hit me in the nuts. Well, I'm glad we spit on both. Yeah. I'm taking the Crosby and I'm not feeling bad about it. Um, overall, pretty good. Overall, pretty good. It's, it, you know, obviously we're chasing a redemption in this uh, product. That's the ideal, aside from the retro Bedard Team Canada, um, very forced rookie that they put into it. Um, never know who the wild card could be. The wild card could be somebody good. Um, mm -hmm. Obviously, it's probably not going to be Bedard, but it still could be somebody who's all right. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's kind of funny. In, in past artifacts, we almost always grab a redemption. Almost always a yeah. redemption in the yeah. box. Uh, some some boxes we've opened two redemptions in the box and mm -hmm. never end up being good. So it's funny how now we want the redemption. All we got out of it was one wild card. But um, I think you know, depending on if the price of this product goes up or down, um, I'd, I'd be open to doing another one. I think we did mm -hmm. well enough in yours that it's worth giving another shot, at least into one more box, um, and then save our money for uh, series one that's coming out in a month and a half. Yeah. Uh, but there you have it. Let us know how you did in your artifacts boxes. I've seen them all over the place. I've seen some really great boxes and some really crap boxes, and this is kind of a good example of that. Um, but, uh, but yeah, smash that thumbs up button. Press subscribe if you like what you see here. We post content weekly, breaking different boxes, sports, TCG, you name it, but you got to stick around to see it. Uh, we're out of packs. We're out of time. See you guys later.